Today I'm in western Connecticut at Lock Rock Park, an area steeped in a passion for motorsports, and I'm surrounded by these race cars, which were just built by the next generation of enthusiasts through a program called the Winter Circle Project. So the Winter Circle Project is an educational nonprofit that partners with high schools to build racing organizations led by students. We give them every single aspect of real racing while they're learning arts, math, science, technology, and just learning how to come together as a team. It's not about the best built car, honestly. It's about building really good human beings. Each school gets the basic kit and then they have to actually raise money for any of the things they want to do. So it's a real life project where they're learning to be a racing organization from the ground up. Some of them put some slicks on their tires because they wanted to be more race ready. From the painting aspect of it, for the twin turbos they put on it, like all the kids' real imaginations were able to be put into use. They're really learning project management. They have timelines that they have to do and hit. Not only do they have to coordinate with the marketing team to make sure that the build team is doing well, they get a chance to actually see the, the same cars they're building in simulators in a race. The cars being auctioned off allows the program to be sustainable. It's been really difficult for schools to be able to really support a project like this because it, it is expensive in racing, right? And so we're learning the real life scenarios that are happening. Uh, so without Meekum, we wouldn't be able to be where we are. As the Winter Circle Project, we give the money back into the schools so they can buy their next kit. So we were really hoping to find the, you know, the best auction house ever. And I reached out and I can't believe how unbelievably blessed we are to have Meekum here and involved and make our program sustainable. Without an auction house like Meekum, we wouldn't be able to give these opportunities to these students. It's been great to watch. We are at Lime Rock Park. The first thing we did was three times Trans Am champion, Chris Dyson got a chance to actually test all of these cars for the performance aspect. You get to see the marketing presentation, which is being judged live, and this is all part of the culmination of everything they did throughout the year. So not only is it the performance aspect of it, but also how the car was built and how well they told the story. And so today we came here to hear the story of the year, and it blew me away how much better they've gotten every single year. They're working together and building communities. The communities have actually come together to really support them. Just like this event that we had today, you don't usually get board members and family members that come out to, uh, you know, you don't see that in a biology class, right? Like nobody gets excited to see what they're gonna do there. It's been wonderful because we have uh, partnerships like Alfred State uh, Motorsports who, some of our kids have started to go down the automotive trade there. Also our partnership with BMW, where kids are really, really thinking about becoming techs. I mean, it's just been remarkable to see if you give kids an opportunity, what they could do. A very unique collection coming from a very unique program with the one goal of fueling the next generation of motorsports enthusiasts. Look for this set to race across the auction block at Meekham Harrisburg.